Oh, guys, right. Um, this is bloody clever. Um, it's, I mean, I've just gone down a bit of a rabbit hole. I'll explain why. Because I was wondering how to improve um, my uh, YouTube uh, results, as it were. And it turns out everyone wants stuff on their phones now. Um, and then uh, just typed in, I don't know, AI to produce um, YouTube videos from, uh, uh, sorry, uh, shorts from um, existing long videos. And it's very clever, <laughs> very clever. So I stuck in one using about using the F12, and uh, we'll play it now. My mouse is really giving me. Hello, people. This is going to be a relatively quick video because the whole point of it is well, there's two points. One, the F12 button. Not sure if anyone's aware of that, but you can uh, use the F12. I'm going to start that was my scroll, but I'm going to use the F12 now to start scrolling one bar at a time. F12, 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 F12. And what I'm on the 30 minute, and what I would use this for, or was using it for, was to see how many times the break, the bust, and then the break and close of the bust bar, as it were, after a pullback, so um, would, would yield a profitable potential trade. So, that way you can sort of randomly pick your part of a chart well we'll do it now so let's have a look at another one same video they produced another one here we go uh that's no good i'll close my eyes and do it again here we go randomly picking my eyes are shut i promise right we're on a random part of the chart now so what I want to see is a bust out like that and then a pullback and then a break and close above the high of the bust out. And as you can see on this particular chart here, it was a win. So we would have entered on this bar here, which is this one here, and that would have been a um, open 8.06, high 8.13. So that was a 7 pip. I just I'm I'm just blown away. I haven't even looked at this one. So what have we got? It's just it's produced these from one five minute seven oh no seven minute video. I, I haven't even scratched the surface. I I just put something into a link online on this clap and then um and then it's done everything. So you can edit it, you can change the transcript script and it will do it. This on my charts five months out of probably six, best part of sixteen years now. Uh, four months out of 16 years, so I think there's a massive amount to learn. And um, here we go, bust, pull back, break and close. We could consider shorting this now after making sure we've got the correct uh, um, pullbacks and continuations in play. And is this one going to be a winner to the short? So it seems to be um oh there's a fourth one as well oh and a fifth one i didn't realize oh and another one oh my god that's all just one click. so technically not a long trigger but it'd be interesting if we break the 20 now after this pullback we're clearly above a resistance uh, level here that's the only thing we can't do by doing this f12 thing is put support and resistance which is on the left so um, for a complete um, Neanderthal, this this suggests to me that if I want to improve these things, then I've got to. Um, by the way, it's um, I think it's about twenty five quid, sixty quid, and one hundred and fifty quid for uh, purchase. But literally, this is the result of about a coffee. So. 25 30 minutes uh, browsing around the internet and I found this <laughs> it's just crazy so we are told you can get you know thousands and thousands of extra uh, views by producing stuff for mobile phones as opposed to sort of dozens and dozens that's currently happening happening um, so I mean obviously uh, I'm a, a 
just a trader, but I love all this uh, technology stuff. So by all accounts, I can change this. I imagine if I edit this and put, you know, the sort of clickbait on here that you, you know, you want to drive people to your Twitter feed or your, um, you know, your uh, YouTube longer term videos, as it were, or maybe even playlists, then you, you can just put that in here and edit it. I, you, the only way I can edit um, currently is to sign up. So I'm going to have a good old uh, walk down the rabbit holes and have a play and see what happens. Just blown away. One click and uh, it's produced six videos from one video. Um, I'm assuming that if I wanted to use this in, my, in its current format, because unless anyone knows, any of my followers that just happen to watch this, know a way of producing i did look it up yesterday and just gave up in the end producing video shorts from a laptop um in one go then that'd be good but the work workaround i'm thinking about is um is to uh focus i mean the edit facility i don't know whether you can move because obviously i'm looking at the live part of the chart um, and this is looking at a central part. Now maybe you can use X and Y horizontal and whatnot to uh, bring in the main part, the focus of your video. If not, then I've just got to focus making long videos with um, the, the central part, but that needs some um, playing with. But just another little rabbit hole um, while it's raining here. I plan to, the sun didn't come out today as expected. But it's supposed to for midday and the tide's right. I'm going to have a lovely long walk and lunch out with friends. So, making short videos from existing long videos um, using AI. Incredible stuff, really. And that's my main... On this particular chart here, it was a win. Uh, we would have entered on this bar here, which is this one here. And that would have been a... Um, open 806 high 813 so that was a seven pip uh in inclusive of spread so net of spread probably about uh, two pips five pip per winner so you got the gist now so in this instance now we've got a bust to the downside we've had a pull back so using f12 we're waiting for either a break of that or in fact because the pullback busted above the number